This is Ken Pyle and we're at MTA 2014. We're with Fritz Hendricks of Envoy. Fritz, you just uh, had a presentation, uh, you and your group, about uh, a lot of business services and a lot of MVNO type things. Why don't you give us a brief synopsis and we'll talk a little bit about it. Okay, well we're looking at uh, rolling out a couple of different platforms. We have uh, two of them in market right now and one of them, you know, soon to come to market. We are a wholesale carrier nationwide. Our goal is to stay one step away from the retail customers and put services in the hands of rural telephone companies that allow them to expand outside of their geographic area and offer services that they might not otherwise be able to put into production without um, external um, support from a company like ours. So the first is a wholesale CLEC service, which offers all of our customer base and potential customer base um, connectivity to the voice network nationwide. And, and by that, I mean the telephone company can use their own soft switch and connect to RPSTN network and deliver dial tone to nearly 7,500 rate centers in the United States today and will be at 9,500 in about another month. The second phase of that is, is offering a unified communication as a service platform. This will enable a total end office replacement or supplement to the existing rural telephone company's um, switching platform that allows for all the web type services such as, you know, presence and um, devices like uh, iPhones and Androids, devices like uh, iPads, and to tie those platforms to the business line so that, you know, together they appear as one device to the customer. And by using our unified communication platform and our wholesale c like service together, they can offer service anywhere in the United States to their consumers. And what we think is the ILEX are excellent at serving customers. Mm -hmm. They might not have the reach that um, we have, you know, because of our national footprint, but they, they know how to serve customers, they know how to serve them well, and with the churn of landlines, you know, in their traditional market, this provides them a growth footprint outside of their regional service area. And then the third phase of that, which is in development, but nearly complete within the next quarter, um, we're uh, implementing a full wireless play with it. So we have an MVNO infrastructure in place where the device, the cell phone, is tied to the business line in a much tighter way. It's not an app on the device. It is literally, um, you know, p the number on the desk phone and the number on the cell phone is the same number. And the, our customers, the I Royal Ilex, will be able to order that service through a portal um, using their own OSS and BSS systems and making calls to our system and turning on that service in combination with the unified communication service. So we're taking the unified communication as a service platform and tying it to a wireless play and allowing um, national reach of a single number play. So, so with that, you know, there's features inside of that wireless play like um, Wi-Fi enabled. It's, it's aware of wireless networks. When you walk into your business, that cell phone will kick over to the wireless network and you won't know it. So you go from cell phone service into your building, go to inside of the building, it kicks over to Wi-Fi as you're walking to your desk, get to your desk, pick it up on your desk phone. It's that tightly integrated. Um, same thing on the outbound direction. You're on your desk phone, you move over to your cell phone device, you walk out the door, it switches to the cell network. It's not using the data side of the mm -hmm. cell network, it's using the, um, the, voice side. the voice side of the cell network. And so it's, uh, it's really unique. Um, Chris Brown, who is you know, here with me, um, is the developer mm -hmm. uh, you know, of the platform. Well, come on over, Chris. Yeah, you just step right in here. <laughs> You're in the spotlight. So Chris, one of the things that you demonstrated uh, up there was this ability to uh, really use, use one of these uh, cell phones just like it was your desktop phone. Yeah. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about the magic behind that? Well, that's like the whole idea. The whole idea is to create like a seamless situation where you don't have two different things that don't speak to each other. Like we live in a world where it's always been you have your cell phone, you have your desk phone, they're completely separated and trying to talk to the, to the office phone system you have to use an app or data connection or stuff like that which creates like quality issues and everything. We wanted to create a seamless situation where your actual work mobile cell phone is your work mobile cell phone. Um, to where you're not reliant upon data, you're not reliant upon Wi-Fi, you're not reliant upon some type of app to connect you back. Like your actual mobile phone calls can be recorded, they're part of the whole ecosystem of the uh, business, 
um, towards just one solution. You know. So, now, is that still is the SIM card in there? Is that tied to that phone number, that business phone number, or can you also have it for personal use too? Yeah, you can have up to 100 numbers on your on your actual mobile phone. So you can have personal numbers, you can have like special numbers set up for like VIP clients. There's a lot of complication that you can add into it, but it doesn't have to be complicated. It seems like one of the big benefits to this, and we spoke of this last year at the show, was the whole separation of a personal and uh, business in this BYOD yep. world, right? Bring your own device. Yep, you can set your own caller ID for your personal calls, set your own caller ID for your office calls. Um, that's all completely managed. Um, the main thing is, is knowing that it's not separated completely, mm -hmm. like how things have we've been accustomed to. Um, so you, you don't need the rubber band with two cell phones anymore with the approach you're taking? No, not at all. No, this is a completely seamless experience. Now, even though Wi-Fi and internet connection is not required, it can be used to offload the cost. Sure. Um, and it does a seamless, I think you were mentioning it before, it does do a seamless handover. So if I'm in my car and I drive away and I'm in the middle of a phone call, I don't have to tell someone I got to call them back or anything like that. Just automatically, that quick, quicker than I can snap, it converges over uh, to the voice side. Um, very unique very unique solution that just kind of ties everything into a unified, in the real term, unified communications. Well, Chris, appreciate your, uh, your insight, and thank Fritz, you. appreciate yours. Right, Thanks. Thank you. yep.